Hello there. <laughs> I'm ready for my close-up, Mr. DeVille. <laughs> hey, guys. Um, I felt like being somebody else for today. So, uh, yes. Yes. What is she? Belle? B-E-L-L-E? <laughs> model, model? Yes, I am her for today. Do not judge me, because I ain't the only one. But, yes, I know that you can see my baby hairs. I know that. This was just to review this wig that I hadn't reviewed, and... Um, I felt like being somebody else for today. Period. Period. So if you want to see me turn from red dreads to this, then keep watching. This is a light um, makeup, everyday look for me, which I do, do pretty much every day. And all I do is change the lip color. And if I want to throw some color in there, then I do my shadows. But other than that, this is an everyday light coverage makeup look. So, if you want to see this, stay tuned. Let's get started. Okay, I'm going to start off by putting these clips in my hair. Get these inches out my face. <laughs> then I'm going to start drawing in my eyebrows with the Anastasia Brow Pencil. And I think that color that I have... What color is it? What color is it? I think it's dark brown. Don't stop me to line. and I cannot find it right now so yes move along I'm using the LA Pro concealer in toffee to clean up my brows whatever you do to one you go ahead and do to the other It's gonna work my nerve that I haven't found that pencil yet and I do the top too with what is left over on the brush I do a lot of cleaning up with my fingertips because it works for me I like it better go ahead now but yes and I go in with my color corrector LA looks in the red color that looks like a brick almost and I rub it in with my fingertips again and I'm using a lighter color for my highlighting with the LA color it's in fawn again I'm applying it with my fingertips and I put on some foundation which is black radiance in the color cashmere 8412 is my color and I just use the applicator that's inside the bottle and again I put it on with my fingertips until it becomes to my liking and yes the Anastasia pencil was in dark brown I found it <laughs> one time for the one time and I use a flat brush I'm not sure what you call these and I put it on and as best as I can that it gets to my liking then I put the same fawn color LA Pro under my eyes for highlighting and the bridge of my nose and my cupid bow in the bottom of my lip I'm not really big on the contouring with the dark. Um, I just can't get into that. I'm sorry. So if that's what you're wanting on my channel, then walk, walk, walk. But yes, I blend that in with my fingertips as well. Mm, 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 mm. And I get my little handy dandy brush out. And blend in some more to my liking. My eye is a little red because I was picking at it. For me, then I take my liquid liner 
and that's a cover girl liquid liner and I do my wing I am over it with the matching wings because just like eyebrows they will never be sisters and if someone comes up to you and say your wings are not twins you need to punch them dead in their lip because they're looking too hard you in my space but so I finish that wing and I do the other off camera <laughs> I put on some Great Last Mascara. And some eyeliner. I think it's in charcoal. It's a JB though. And I like to accent my little beauty mark. Yes, I already have one there, but it's not dark enough for me. So, huh. Hmm. Fight me. Fight me. And I put on some more LA lash I want to keep coating it up because your girl can't wear lashes and make my eyelids swell up pile it on keep piling it on Ooh, my life flashed before my eyes moment of silence for me almost poking my damn eye out continue and that's my bronzer and that's the artisan color fake bronzer in 3515 I'm using the angle blush, no bronzing brush from e.l.f. to apply that everywhere that I want to <laughs> glow a little bit. Then I have an eyeliner. It's a liner. Maybe a lip liner. No, it's a lip liner. It's in Essence and it's called Melt Your Heart. And I'm putting on a, it's actually a I think a sample from Ray, Ray Blon, Revlon. It's called Hot Plum that my sister gave me. Put it on, girl. Put it on. Rub it in. And clean up my lip. Yeah, I do it with my finger. Fight me. So I blending in some more. Of course, to my liking. <laughs> I'm going to take these pins out and put my little handy dandy, what do you call it, stocking rag on my hair. <laughs> All these inches, girl. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Don't judge me. Make sure I get them all in there. Don't want no red locks hanging out the back of your wig. Come on, get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there. I would usually put on a brown one or a nude one, but like I said, this is for the review and I don't have one. Woo! Guns for days. And this wig is the Model Model. And I think it's what? B E L L E. Bell? Belly? Whatever you want to call it. I don't know. But it has the blonde underneath and it has the dark top. And I plucked this wig which you will see in a minute because the one on that box girl honey you no know, honey you could not see any kind of part and I'm brushing her out because I haven't had her on in a while yeah see I picked that part it comes with combs and you can wear it on the side or in the middle I'm not really a middle kind of person so I always wear it on the side no so and voila <laughs> yes, honey. Who are we today? Who are we today? Belly, belly, whatever. However you say that, but I'm her. <laughs> Only for a day. Brush it out. Get it how you wanna. And yes, I know you can see my red baby hairs. Don't argue with me. I have red. Baby here. I have baby here. Don't argue with me. It is bugging me that I don't have any baby hairs because usually I would put it on. Put my baby hairs out. I'm spraying rose water on it right now so I can brush it through and get rid of a little bit of the fuzz. But since my baby hairs are red, I cannot pull them out and I didn't want to cut the front of the wig to make any of the um, little baby hairs. Like I said, this is just for the review. So I'm just brushing it out. And I know somebody is going to get in the comments about them red baby hairs. But please don't come for me. 
Because how you say when you go to a job and authority is picking with you, I'm a woman before anything. <laughs> Play with it if you want to. Play with it. But yes, this is for the review. Okay. But I'm still cute. Hmm. But get her like you wanna. And I put um concealer in the part I thought like this. Shake it to the left. Twist it back to the right. <laughs> Wherever is comfortable for you, a hey, put her there. Oh. Fly away. Put that under there. Oh yeah, this is pretty much the um ending it. Let's see, yeah, I got a pimple. We'll put your uh bird box blinds on when you see that. And the baby hairs. And I say again, for the people in the back that's going to act just like, I'm not saying this. <laughs> I say again, I know I can, I know you can see my red baby hairs around my perimeter. Like I said, like I said, I was just doing a, re a wig review. In any other case, if my baby hairs were the same color, I would slick them down with some aloe vera and got to be glued and tie it down so it can be baby hairs now that that has been said carry on thanks for watching guys oh my gosh I was looking at some old videos where I did a review on another model model wig and that will be right here well somewhere up there anyway <laughs> but I've grown how I've grown <laughs> not a lot for all y'all just gonna be haters and leaving that I've grown and I look so dark on there. I mean, melanin is popping. I love being black. But why do I look that dark on that video? Oh, because I wasn't introduced to lighting yet. Yeah. But go and check it out. And stay tuned for more videos. Rate, rate, comment, and subscribe. Why do people say rate? Like there's a bar up there that you can rate. The only thing you can do is click like. So I'm going to change that up. Like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, be you. Because only you can do it best. <laughs>